my own experience with bullying. It starts when I was in fourth grade, and when I was in fourth grade, something very sad happened in my family, and that is my mom and dad got divorced, and that was very sad. And that following summer, my mom moved us to a different neighborhood and a different school. So going into fifth grade, I started at a new school, and I had always been a student who loved school, enjoyed learning, but the first day of fifth grade, one of the other fifth grade girls decided for some reason she didn't like me, and for the next two years, she would spend recess pushing me, in the hallway, when the teachers weren't looking, she would push me around. She would say horrible things to me. But you know what? For some reason, I never said anything. And I think because of my parents going through a divorce, I, did, I felt like I didn't want to burn my mom. And because I was new to the school, I didn't want them to think that I was a troublemaker. So I suffered in silence. And for two years, this went on. And you know what happened? I started not to like school. I started to feel sick to my stomach every day before school. And is that okay for someone to make you feel that way? No. no. And finally, I went to middle school. And you know what? I don't know what happened to her. She was still at school. I think she found somebody else to pick on. But when I think about it now, I feel really sad because I wish I would have spoken up. I wish I would have told my mom. I wish I would have told the teacher. I wish I would have said something to a friend. Because do you think they could have helped me? Yes. Absolutely. So that's my message to you. No one has the right to make you feel unsafe at school, do they? No. no. So if this is going on, I want you to tell somebody, tell your teacher, tell your mommies or daddies or grandparents, tell a friend, but don't suffer in silence the way I did.